Davidson Wildcats in the Atlantic 10 finals. There's a nice touch, but offsides is the call on Duquesne. Duquesne has a lot of players from a lot of different schools in the Division I and Division II areas. An opportunity for the Dukes, cutting that one in, but Robert Morris, first one to get there, and that being an S. Hadran. Room to work with, although takeaway, a bad one for Duquesne. Robert Morris with it, McLaughlin steps, overstep, cuts it back. Tries to curl that one, but he didn't get around it. It's gonna hit off one of the Dukes. Take away from Duquesne. Here are the Dukes, cutting it in. Back over for the Dukes, shot taken, a stop made. Josh Lane was on it, got a foot on it. Commonly known as G Block. Into the box, looking in for the headers. Lane makes a stop and he collects that one at his feet. Flicked forward again. Taken away. Hopfer. Crossing this one in, no one there though for Duquesne. Duquesne. Cutting in, Norris gets a piece of it. And out of play it was Nasser had some pressure on him. Back to Miller as he gets around a defender. Into the box, one header, and it's headed by the defender and the Colonials bench and the head coach, your assistant coach. Crossed in for Robert Morris, Gilly. I think it's just not able to corral that one and get a shot off. The corner kick for the Colonials into the box, headed off the line from Duquesne. That was Thompson who got a header on that one. And a corner kick, but a header. Hackett's. Stands at the keeper position. Still though for Robert Morris, a shot. Tough angle. A screamer to the far post, and that one headed. Who's it off of? It's off of. Duquesne, to be specific, and a goal older than every single person on the crew here this afternoon. Figuring I'm, I believe, the oldest on this crew, and I was born after that. A shot taken! Lane with a stop! What a drive there from Grant McIntosh! High into the air. Goes past everyone. Duquesne will try and get to it. Oh, nice move. Crossing this one in. Deflection, still in the box. Still in possession for the Dukes. Cutting that one in, headed away, off a of Colonial. And Robert Morris will head that forward. After being in it two years ago, they had a thriller against Oakland in the first round. Went to penalty kicks, went to like nine penalty kicks. A shot taken, a goal! Tim Kashoa! Checked out of the game for the injury, comes back in and delivers a strike for Robert Morris. Out of nowhere for the Colonials. Another look again from the speed of an S. Hadran. We have an RMU corner kick. This one in front. Still in dangerous territory. Deflected. Back over off of a, of a defender for Duquesne. Had ran back out to him. Kashula into the box looking for Gilly, and they got it! Logan Gilly scores for Robert Morris. 2 0 Colonials. Off the cross from Tim Kashula. What a day he has had. This one scored by number 11, Logan Gilly! 2-0 Colonials. The clock had stopped due to time constraints for Robert Morris. Into the box, strike taken, collected, but it goes in! It's Kosi Ude who gets it off the rebound, and Robert Morris, what is happening right now? Three goals in the last handful of minutes. 
Duquesne is 18th ranked, but Robert Morris has three on him. Kosi Uday with the goal for the Colonials.